What does eating bread do to the body? Now here I've got some oil and water, which represents the juices in your intestines. Now I'm gonna mix in this wheat bran. This represents what happens in your gut when you digest stuff with insoluble fiber, like whole wheat bread and pasta. Now I'm gonna do the same thing, but instead of wheat bran, we're gonna use soluble fiber rich psyllium husk. Soluble fiber is in foods like avocados, sweet potatoes, and Brussels sprouts. And these right here also contain gut-boosting prebiotics, which are fantastic for helping with weight loss. You're gonna hear more about that in just a minute. Now, as you can see, nothing much has happened with the wheat bran. That's oil that's just floating here at the top. Ugh. Now, personally, I recommend you stay far away from any food containing wheat. This stuff can wreak havoc on your digestive tract and cause all sorts of problems, including weight gain. But here's something really cool. Take a look at the soluble fiber. It turned into a gel. And this gel is so important because it soaks up fats and helps excrete them from our bodies. Because it feeds the good bacteria in your gut, releasing a short chain fatty acid called butyrate. Now, butyrate is responsible for so much of the good stuff we want. Things like smooth, regular digestion, supported blood sugar, and a healthy weight. Look, I, 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 I can't get, I can't get it out.